We believe that natural, affordable, locally grown herbs and trees provide an important and often overlooked solution to the many health challenges facing residents of Tanzania's Lake Victoria region. Our main efforts in this area have been promoting the use of neem to prevent and treat malaria, as well as many other conditions, and the use of Moringa oleifera leaves as a nutritious food supplement to compensate for the substandard diet eaten by many of the area's residents, especially children. Like most sub-Saharan countries, another health challenge Tanzania faces is the high incidence of HIV AIDS. Working with local clinics, GRA is exploring alternative approaches to the treatment of AIDS and the enhancement of patients' natural immunity. GRA is also working to make home births in the Lake Victoria region safer. Most women living in rural villages give birth at home. On our visit to Tanzania in October 2006, we became aware of the difficult conditions under which midwives assisting these births operate and the lack of resources available to support this important event. We have responded to this need by providing grants for basic tools like pots to boil water, scissors to cut the umbilical cord, clean clothes for the mother and baby, and bicycles to make transportation for midwives possible. Female genital mutilation, FGM, is a common practice in villages of the Lake Victoria region of Tanzania. Although FGM is illegal in Tanzania, it is still practiced in many areas of the country, especially in the rural areas surrounding Lake Victoria, where up to 80% of the girls are circumcised. GRA has been working with a local nonprofit organization called Akadea since 2004 to educate communities about the dangers of FGM and to empower young women to make healthier choices for themselves. <laughs> Nani ni nijakufanya? Nani ni nijakufanya?